Well, you know, I've been looking forward to doing this particular project for quite a while and getting the hand-picked people, world-class people that I uh, want to make it happen. And I was lucky and got the best people I know. The chemistry of all these people on this particular project, thank you, God, you know, and I'm Tickle Pink. I think the music will speak for itself. me if I would bring a piece in so I gave him a choice of a few I thought of that would maybe fit his uh, his concept and his style of playing that's why not Great chance to play with great people and uh, to play music uh, that we love. experiences playing with the trumpeter who uh, had ties to Louis Armstrong and Miles Davis so that's incredible in itself but he's played with almost every major artist in this field and he carries that legacy on and pushes it to new heights and I've been the fortunate one to be around him and hopefully carry it forth funky and it's creative and it's going to be a historical record. Well, it's interesting because we just recorded a piece of music that I recorded with Eddie almost 50 years ago. And at the time, Eddie was with the M1 Nishi band with Herbie Hancock, Buster Williams, Julian Priester, Benny Maupin, and Billy Hart. And I played on that record with them, so it was two drummers. We got a little different take on it than we did 50 years ago, but it's Eddie Henderson, Eddie Henderson music, you know, and it's great to play with him again. It's a very interesting dynamic now. People that I've known for 50 years, we're still playing together, so it's somewhat special. <laughs> 